Good afternoon. Hope you're doing well. Saturday, FA Cup day, chance to uh, take our mind off the league for a bit. Catching a bus into town today, having a few beers pre-game and uh, look forward to seeing what on earth is going to happen today. I think we're going to play a, a lineup which is a, a mixture of youth and experience. Let's put it that way. But playing Luton Town, bottom, rooted to the bottom of the championship, we're not doing much better in the Premier League. So two teams that will probably have a lot of fringe players on show, but just a chance to relax and enjoy some football. Just uh, waiting for the bus. I think it's going to be coming any second soon. Meeting uh, my friend Lucy and then uh, meeting a few guys in Inferno and then later on uh, a couple of others too. So yeah, look forward to today. Let's do it. So just left uh, Christopher Creek, uh, had some food and a beer and now off to Inferno. Uh, chat to a few Luton fans in there. Um, they are not feeling optimistic after today. So uh, maybe Bournemouth can get a win. So I've just arrived in the Inferno, and with me is Dan King, Hello. AFC Ball fan. Dan, how are you? I'm good, thank you. How are you feeling about the game today? A little bit nervous. We've got a big chance here to build their confidence today. Hopefully we play a strong team. Um, I don't know who's going to play yet, but um, hopefully some of the youngsters. Uh, if you're ready, how? Obviously, there's one thing you can do is keep momentum yep. and play you know, some of the first teamers ahead of Watford next week, or you can make sure they've got no injuries and play the youth. What would you be doing? Or would you be doing a blend of both? Uh, probably a blend of both. Hopefully we'll get some uh, the opportunity for a day break. I also think um, maybe a goal for Slanky might be nice. One in 42, is it? <laughs> yeah, I so. hope so. Uh, yeah, I hope he'll play. Um, I hope Kilkenny will play. Um, you mentioned Brad Smith might be back. Yeah. Um, it might be interesting. I'm still unsure of uh, Diego Rico. So, Can we have a prediction from you though at this point? Prediction, I'm going to go 3-1 uh, Bournemouth. Luton are near the relegation spot, they need to rest a few players, so I think 3-1 Bournemouth. And I'm going to go for Solanke Hattrick. <laughs> oh my god, 3-1, 3-1. <laughs> and everyone else is pissing themselves. <laughs> <laughs> Just outside the Vitality, and it's a strong AFC Bournemouth lineup tonight. Really strong. Um, I'm expecting good things from tonight. Um, <laughs> don't walk any further. You walk into a bush. Um, yeah, really good performance. Can you see the Vitality over there? That's where we're going, and I've got a feeling 3-1 is probably the right result. AFC Bournemouth three, Blue Town one. I'm drunk. Let's go. Cut. <laughs> Billing. Goal scorer extraordinaire, said no one ever. 
One nil for West. Subway, it is late, it's like half past ten in the evening. Had a few beers pre and after the game. Um, but yeah, it was a it was a fairly solid uh, performance by the Cherries. Uh, quite pleased with the side we put out. I thought it'd be more sort of youth, youthful than what we got. Um, but in the end it was a, a very experienced side against a Luton Town side that is obviously concentrating on its league form rather than the cup run. It's nice for Bournemouth to get, at least get that 4-0 win. Um, yeah, who knows who we'll get in the next round, but maybe um, it'll be another home tie and a, a chance to build a little bit more momentum. But yeah, I'm quite pleased with what we saw today. 
I don't think that anything I saw makes me um, overly enthusiastic about Watford next weekend, but I'm hoping that we can at least put in a good performance there. And for people like Dom Solanke, it would have given it would have given him a little bit more confidence because it was great to see him score. One of them obviously disallowed, one of them allowed. Um, and also Callum Wilson as well getting on the score sheet as well. Philip Billing, great to see him involved too. So yeah, uh, four nils to Bournemouth, relatively happy. And on to the next one. Let's, uh, let's see if we can keep this momentum going. Other cherries. Oscar, back in the day! Oscar, back in the day! Oscar, back in the day!